Hey, welcome. In the next lecture, we are going to be able to retrieve our categories and also display our categories over here. Okay, but before then, what we want to do is over here, we want to have a divider and then a test, which is going to say categories. And also, we're going to be able to reset our test form field. Okay, now to do this, we have to go back to our VS Code. And right after the row widget still within the column widget we can then have a divider this will basically produce a horizontal straight line and also we can give this a color of colors to gray okay and now we can then have a container and child there's going to be a test widget and this is going to say categories. And also we can give this a style. Style and test style. Test. Style. And basically we just want to increase the font size to 36 to make this or 30. Or we can just go with 36. And also we can give this a font width. A font width. Font width, put bold. Add your comma and use control and to go save. And we can then check this out. Okay, and categories. And you can see we have the horizontal straight line. And you can see now we have this test. And what we want to do is within the container, it has a property known as alignment. And we can then say alignment alignment dot top left okay if i to save and you're going to see it at the top then the left okay sounds good and we can also wrap this with a pattern divider wrap with pattern we can just go with the, with the default eight and also we can wrap this with a padding and also we can just go with the default eight and lastly we want to be able to reset our test form field to do this within the set state we just have to call the underscore from key from key then we have to get the current state of the form current state and reset it dot reset and also we need to add a not check over here. Use control and to save and it's gonna work as expected. You can just upload a new category and it's gonna reset that field also. Okay, okay guys, see you in the next lecture.